be doing, Freya? Walk, good girl. Well done. Walk, good girl. So, this is Freya. Full name is Corel Spots Galore. She is a six year old British spotted pony mare, and we've had her since she was two and believe it or not she is actually Ruby's half sister <laughs> you would never know to look at her but she is um, yeah and she's a lovely affectionate little mare very clever knows every trick in the book very cheeky when she wants to be yes you are aren't you but she is very loving um, yeah, and uh, our aim for her is that she'll one day be a driving pony and that hopefully we will be able to put her as a pair with Ruby in the carriage eventually. Uh, but, oh, but her training is actually taking a bit longer than we wanted it to because uh, she needed that little bit of extra time just to mature. Ooh. and also we've uh, she's technically my mum's pony and I try to kind of let my mum do most of the stuff with her with training so she's still very green she is lunging and long reining well and she also enjoys short walks in hand like this um, but she just really needed that extra time to kind of like mature her and Ruby are quite similar in the respect that they're both quite opinionated. However, Ruby is kind of like the brakes of the operation, if you know what I mean. I feel like when we go as a pair, if they go as a pair, she will be the brakes, whereas Freya will be the accelerator. She's very quick. She's quick to react and uh, she loves bit of a speed demon basically whereas Ruby tends to be a little bit calmer but then again Ruby's that little bit older and more experienced through the water then yay um Freya sometimes struggles with focus um sometimes if there's a lot going on her focus her attention gets drawn away from me and onto whatever else is going on but she's working on it and I think even though she's still very green and hasn't even been broken to harness yet I think she needed that extra time she's uh yeah I think if we'd have rushed it I think we would have ruined her but as you can see she's a beautiful pony she's a proper drop her stuff kind of pony as well but she can be a bit of a challenge can't you good girl oh look there's people hey what are you doing hiya good girl who is it who is it <laughs> hiya Hi. good girl <laughs> good girl, walk. Good girlie. No. <laughs> You're alright, aren't you? Hey. Good girl. Well done. Clever pops. And as you can see, she does uh, react a little bit. Gets a bit distracted, but she is fabulous. She is going to be worth her weight in gold when she does finally get broken in. But we're not in a rush, you know, she's with us for life and as a result, we really aren't rushing anything. It takes however long it takes, but if we were to rush it, then I feel like we would be letting ourselves in for 
a lot of safety issues and would also run the risk of uh, destroying her confidence. Good girl. But yeah, I, I really love Freya. She's a proper little smart cookie, proper cheeky girl. Uh, you have to be a bit careful what you let her do because if you let her walk, you let her get away with something once, she'll keep doing it. She doesn't miss a trick. Very intelligent and uh, very feisty at times. Stand. Stand. Yeah. Stand. See, this is one of the things that we do have to practice, standing still without too much fidgeting. Good girl, hand on. And we just do that in short little in increments. You know, second, maybe raise it up to 10 seconds and then, you know, everything in between. Not make a big deal out of it. And the best, the biggest thing with Freya is that whereas with Ruby, I can talk to her a lot. I can kind of jeer up a bit using my voice. I kind of have to keep my tone kind of neutral when it comes to Freya because Freya's a whole different ball game. <laughs> she gets herself a little bit wound up sometimes, but she is fabulous and we love her to bits. We wouldn't have her any other way, but she is definitely a challenging girl when she wants to be. Oh look! Poops! Yeah! And now I'm going to ask her for a steady jog. And walk! Good girl! Now that was something that she really really struggled with when we first got her. She would just get really excited and totally ignore me. So uh, the fact that she's listening boop, boop, and walk and stand good girl that was perfect and on good girl she's very clever aren't you girl <clears throat> very proud of her and left so as you can see left good girl I'm teaching her everything that she needs to know Hey, no jumping to uh, get her to be a really good driving pony we can do it all on the ground as I've said before before we even attempt to do it in the, between the shafts hey stropper and her favourite thing to do like now is she'll try to knock me over and the reason she does that is not because she's aggressive or anything but simply because my mum is shorter than me and if Freya tilts her head under my mum's arm my mum gets knocked off balance and although my mum hasn't let her go or anything Freya knows that she can sort of uh, have a bit of an advantage by doing that Ooh, good girl and Freya's really pissed off because she knows that 